If you're thinking of starting a digital business, you have to do so on a platform that allows you to be easily discovered, on a platform that allows you to scale, and on a platform that makes it easy for you to customize things however you want. So here are 14 reasons why you should always consider building your digital business on WordPress. I am Tony Lewis with Thrive Themes and here is your friendly reminder to hit the like button and to subscribe to our YouTube channel to make sure that you don't miss out on any awesome content. All right, let's jump right into it. Number one, SEO friendliness. Your content needs to be discoverable. It's probably even one of the main reasons why you're thinking about setting up an online business. And there is no other platform as friendly to Google as WordPress, mainly because WordPress has been around for over two decades now. It came out in 2003 and Google is already familiarized with the ins and outs of how WordPress websites are structured, how they are typically set up with, you know, their own themes, how sitemaps are typically inserted into websites. And it just, it's already familiarized with WordPress content in general. And we know to be a fact that it's easier to rank WordPress websites than it is to try to rank a website site that is uh, set up on some of these newer platforms that are coming out now. Number two, customization options. One of the things that makes WordPress such a powerful platform to build your business on is that you've got over 50,000 plugins to help you build your business. Some of these plugins are free. Some of these plugins are paid, but each particular plugin tries to solve, tries to tackle a problem to make your experience building your online business on WordPress much easier. Something really quick that I want to point out here is that you want to make sure that you're not just installing plugins for the sake of installing plugins. Each plugin adds in a little bit of code onto your website. And if you start just randomly installing plugins, it's going to make your website run a little slower. So just make sure that you're only installing whatever plugins you're going to be making use of. Number three, the power of no code. It's amazing how far no code technology has come forward in today's day and age. On WordPress, you can build out amazing, beautiful websites without writing a single line of code using tools like Thrive Architect. And you can take this as far as you want. I mean, I've been personally able to replicate designs like the New York Times, and I've been able to replicate designs like Abercrombie and Fitch. So you can take your businesses as far as you want in terms of design. Design-wise, there is no limit as to what you can build on WordPress. Number four, security. We can comfortably say that you can run a profitable online business on WordPress without any major hiccups. There are some great security plugins like WordFence or security that will keep all of that nasty traffic away from your website. And when you combine that with using a good hosting provider, you shouldn't experience any major headaches. Number five, price. I'm not gonna get on camera and pretend that building an online business on WordPress is free, even though WordPress is technically open source and that anyone is free to build a business on WordPress, you're still gonna have to pay for some basic stuff like hosting, uh, like a security plugin, a page, a page builder like Thrive Architect. So it, even though it's not free, it is very affordable to be building a business using WordPress. Number six, user interface and user experience. From a front-end perspective, you can build beautiful websites that offer a great user experience for your customers, and you can do so without writing a single line of code using tools like Thrive Architect. And from a back-end perspective, some people do get scared of some of the terminology that people use on WordPress, like widgets, plugins, themes. You don't have to be scared about this. Managing a business on WordPress is super easy, and once you get through the learning curve, which is not crazy at all, you'll soon realize that it's, you know, super easy to manage your online business on WordPress. Number seven, community. All right, let's say that you're an entrepreneur and you're trying to solo build your online business and you bump into some weird error message or you bump into a wall that you just don't know how to overcome. Well, newsflash, I'll be very surprised if you're the first person to first encounter an error on WordPress. Chances are plenty of people before you have already encountered that very same error and you're a simple Google search away from actually finding your solution. There are plenty of people online willing to help you out if you encounter any issues. There's a lot of Facebook groups. There's a lot of online forums that you can reach out to to get some help. And the online community is just amazing. Number eight, performance. Whether you're building your online business on WordPress or you're building it elsewhere, the performance of your website is going to be directly linked to how well you're optimizing it. 
There are some great habits that you can follow, like making sure that you're using a good caching service, making sure that you're signing up for a content delivery network, making sure that your images are optimized before you're putting them online, making sure that you're using a well-optimized theme like Thrive Theme Builder. Good news is that we've got some awesome guides on how you can do all of these things inside Thrive University. There's a link down below in the description box. Check it out if you're interested. Number nine, integrations. Okay, but how easy is it to integrate your website, your online business, with applications that live outside of WordPress? Well, depending on what tools you're using, it's gonna be more or less easy. If you're creating opt-in forms with Thrive Leads, for example, it's super easy to connect them up to your CRM. Plus, Thrive Themes just released Thrive Automator this year, which can connect your website to a growing ecosystem of plugins, tools, and services. For the following points, let me just run through really briefly on some specific use case scenarios that may be interesting to you if you're a content creator or a coach or you're trying to build out an e-commerce or something like that. If you're a content creator, WordPress is your platform. WordPress is literally a content management system. It was originally intended to store large amounts of content pieces and make it super easy for people online to discover them. So whether you're doing audio, video, or especially long form written content, you have to pick WordPress. Plus at some point, you may be interested in offering more than just content. You may be interested in selling your knowledge. You may be interested in setting up sales funnels. You may be interested in offering more than just your content. And having all of your content on WordPress is going to allow you to expand your business without having to take your already published content elsewhere. But what if you're a coach? Two words, Thrive Apprentice. If you're a coach, if you're a teacher, if you're interested in selling your knowledge, you have to pick WordPress because inside WordPress, you're going to get access to Thrive Apprentice. Thrive Apprentice is the best learning management system that you can use to sell your knowledge. This will allow you to create beautiful info products that will help you monetize your content and your knowledge. There are already thousands of happy customers using Thrive Apprentice to sell digital courses, all the way from fitness to yoga. I've even seen people selling courses on how to train your dog to bring you your sleepers. And what about e-commerce? Like I mentioned earlier, I've actually been able to replicate some of the biggest stores that you can possibly think of, whether it's Zara, whether it's Abercrombie & Fitch, you can build powerful e-commerce stores using Thrive Architect and Thrive Theme Builder. Like I said, WordPress offers over 50,000 plugins that you can choose from to expand the power that your website has to offer. And when you combine powerful tools like Thrive Architect and WooCommerce, boom, you can do beautiful things. All right, Tony, but I just want to sell something really quick. I just want to build out a quick sales funnel. Do I really need WordPress? Well, yes. I mean, if you want to make your life easier, you do need WordPress. With WordPress, you can literally just install a lightning fast theme, like Quick, for example, that comes with Thrive Theme Builder, customize it to your needs, and you're good to go. You're going to enjoy lightning fast pages, and you can customize them to fit your needs. And the last point that I want to talk to you guys about is freedom. You have the freedom to scale. With WordPress, you can start small and you can scale as much as you want. But hey, you don't really even need to trust my word. Here are a few examples of powerful businesses that are built on WordPress. Sony Music is built on WordPress. The PlayStation blog is powered by WordPress. Time Magazine, Disney Books, Mashable, Microsoft News, even the White House blog is powered by WordPress. So hopefully with this video, I've helped you clarify a few things on whether it's still a great idea today to build your online business on WordPress. In the description box down below, you're gonna find a link to get Thrive Suite, which combines the most advanced tools to building profitable online businesses on WordPress. It's been a pleasure. I'm Tony Lewis with Thrive Themes and I'll see you guys in the next video.